All right. Hi. Welcome from Nashville. My name's Jamie Ways. And today, we're going to try to figure out what to do with plastic barrels. I've melted a bunch of HDPE together before and made sheets out of it, which I use to build my cajones and other things. But today, we're going to make tiles for my bus, for the shower stall. And uh, we start out with a barrel like this. And of course, we rip off the top and the bottom. And then we have a big round sheet that we cut into squares. And, and then we have to heat them and flatten them. So I'll show you how we do that. We come this way. Perfect mess on the ground here. We've been kind of busy, so. So anyway, this is uh, one of my earlier inventions. This is actually a t-shirt press for uh, making t-shirts. And I built this out of an old frying pan. A bunch of old metal I had laying around. It works pretty darn good for uh, t-shirts, but it also works really good to flatten uh, HDPE. So uh, I'm going to show you how we do that. We put it in here, we leave it in for about 10 minutes using parchment paper on each side of it until it's nice and flat. And then of course as it cools off, we have as it cools off we have to keep it flat. So what I do I stick it between two boards and put some weight on it and let it sit and cool. Once we get that done, we cut it to size on the table saw because, of course, HDPE is like cutting wood. You can cut it on the table saw. It's kind of hard on the blade, but it works pretty well. So we're going to go into the bus now, and I'm going to show you what I'm doing with them. So this is a, uh, uh, a work in progress. This is my new little tour bus I picked up. And we got the engine all fixed up and running. Got a steel on this thing. So I can spend some time doing this. And as most songwriters don't have any money, we have to find new and exciting ways to uh, accomplish our goals. So this is one of mine to accomplish my goals. I don't know if it's going to work yet or not, but we're working on it. When we're done, we have a tile that looks similar to this. Of course, you could clean it up and make it look all pretty and exactly the same color, but I kind of think that takes away from the, uh, the look of it. And uh, so we're going to use this one just the way it is. And I'm going to show you how we set them down in there. I tried a couple different uh, waterproofing membranes, and none of them seemed to work. So I went back to something that... I use for years for caulking windows and keeping water out of everything else, and that's silicone. 100% silicone. What could be more waterproof than that? So what we're doing today is we're taking and we basically are lining the whole back of this tile with silicone. Now we've already cut this to size, so that's not going to be a problem. And. Uh, As we're doing this, I'd like to tell you some other stories, but I don't have any right now. I am 